Fox 4 News was first to bring you exclusive body cam video of the high drama surrounding a movie theater robbery Tuesday night in Lancaster. Today, new video of the ambush, robbers terrorizing and beating the Cinemark Theater's assistant manager. Police want you to see this video because there might be clues that identify the men behind the masks. Fox 4's James Rose highlights those clues. Well, Clarice, investigators say these men are dangerous and violent, and this surveillance video shows just how quickly this robbery could have become a murder. We were just robbed. There was three males. Did they have a knife or gun? Yes, they had a weapon. The call to 911 came moments after three robbers stormed the Cinemark Theater office, catching the manager off guard. The man wearing the scream mask sticks a pistol into the ribs of the 19-year-old worker. The other two robbers quickly follow. One goes into a back room. The other starts taking loose money off a table. Moments later, one of the robbers pulls out a can of spray paint and blacks out the lens. But let's take a closer look. When we enhance the video, you can see the manager actually grabs the gun, trying to push it away as he's forced to open the safe. The suspect is trying to get the manager to open the safe, which he's doing his best to comply as best as he can. While all three suspects are dressed in black, wearing hoodies, masks, and gloves, investigators also point out something unusual. One of the suspects with the spray paint can has on gray, gray colored, almost like loafer type shoes uh, uh, with white trim. As soon as the manager opens the safe, police say the suspect hit the manager with a gun four times, knocking him to the ground. Uh, that's very concerning because that's that's pretty aggressive. The door on the right. Okay. Yeah, I got a blind spot on the left. Got it. Coming out. Good. Blue. Blue. Even though police arrived within minutes, they believe the robbers were already gone when the officers swarmed the theater, evacuating 200 patrons and sweeping the entire building. That's why they want everyone to take a close look at this video, because police hope the robbers can be identified by their movements or mannerisms. Now, investigators are also hoping they may get more clues from surveillance cameras from neighboring businesses. And it goes without saying, but if you recognize anyone in that video, you are urged to call police. Clarice? James, hopefully that can help. Thanks.